This channel has gained over 2000 subs in less than 2 weeks and just a video uploaded. The video now has almost 80,000 views and this channel shows us the proof that you still can have blowing video from scratch even without a face. First and foremost, an ad wealth. Here I call it an ad. He used a catalyst to boost the views. His previous channel is called an ad dev, a game developing channel now with over 31,000 subs. Before, he had made two community posts to run his channel, but this promotion only can bring a few 10 or 100 views. How can you blow out a video rapidly to gain over 80,000 views from scratch? Now, YouTube has an audience to test this video. If the click through rate and average view duration are good enough, YouTube will start to pushing to more audience. If a channel is doing the right thing, a shout out will lead to a snowball effect. But if a channel isn't optimized enough, the shout out from a larger channel can bring an opposite effect. Until here, we can know his first video is great and loved by algorithm. So now I will go deeper into how could we learn from his first video to approach being loved by algorithm. The first thing we could learn is having a graph hook. Let's watch his intro. My main YouTube channel brings in about $2,000 a video at 30,000 subscribers. I started it when I was only 14 years old, knowing nothing. And now at 16, I've turned it into a business. Here's how you can do the same with just $20 and a laptop. This intro is such graph hook. I break it down into four different factors. First, direct to the most curious part at the beginning, like how to make and how he made a passive income. This proof he delivered the promise made on the title, so he gained the trust from the audience. For example, title is passive income. And at the hook, he said he made $2,000 from his main channel at 30,000 subs. He gains the trust point and one curious point. Then he told a tiny but hooky story about he started with nothing at age 14, but now turned it into a business at age 16. And he said, how can you do the same with $20 and with a laptop? Now, the audience will feel, whoa, how can I do the same as you to build money income of $2,000 on YouTube just from 20 bucks and one laptop? This even hits two crisp points, now with a total of one trust point and three crisp points. Again, in order to highlight the impact of $2,000 and 30,000 subs, he put some impressive virtual effects and sound effects to grab the audience's full attention. This is one more attention point. The second thing is the content part. His theme is the finance and YouTube. Two niche content, no big but not small too. Thus, this will bring to a wider audience compared to one niche. But this also means the competition is much higher. The video is more like a tutorial and consists of 11 steps. For tutorials, most men feel boring and though it is an 11-step tutorial, but the actual content itself is not that complicated, not hardcore thing. Reversely, it's good and relaxing to anyone, especially beginners, as easy to revise and digest all the points. The advices he gave are just great to start. The video script is interesting. Like I mentioned, the words, the examples, the actions he mentioned are just simple, easy to understand, no insider language present. I only can say he knows very well about his target audience and that video is just mainly meant for them. This will cause his audience willing to watch his video again and again until the return rate for viewers increases. Thirdly, editing is sick. In fact, he hired a video editor. So how could we learn from his video editor? Number one, the footage from this video can be obtained from pixels. Pixel Bear or other free sites. These are not the actual footage he personally put efforts and record using Pro Camera. Even though they are the stock footage, he still used sparingly and wisely in different situations. Number two, he knows really well at using the text on screen method to highlight the important points. Then I realized the video is fast pacing, like the video clip he put is not longer than 5 seconds. This means he charged visually every 1 to 5 seconds. I know as people now can easily get bored with one long video, so this is aimed to always recapture the attention. However, it's still comfortable to watch. This brings to the four things we can learn, background music and sound effects. I know he is hiring an editor, but the music and the sounds make his video even more interesting. There are various different background music editors into the video. For example, he used one music for each step to suit the situation. Also, he stopped the music for some important nouns to get it focus. And he used various sound effects family to make his video joyful. Additionally, 
His voiceover is clean and clear. As for faceless channel, your voice is the man's soul instead of a face. As audience will hear your voice but not see your face expression. Next, let's talk about M8's title and thumbnail strategy. Title strategy he used is something classic like the how to style. Then his thumbnail is also very attention ready. Like the success elements contain the money earned, the rising graph with glows, and a green arrow. The dark background is to highlight the white woods and the blue glows with an additional green arrow as an indicator of increased size. This thumbnail is not complex but still a powerful design. In my opinion, this video's vlog is not an accident and he didn't even invent new viral method or on-screen method. He just used what has already worked. So probably he's more experienced than the expectation. Lastly, if you want to learn how to write a clickable YouTube title, then you can click on this video right now.